The Black Swan set of zero-day vulnerabilities is absolute gold for an attacker. What it allows an attacker to do is raise their level of execution to the point where an operating system is no longer able to defend against these types of attacks. They are extremely exploitable in a very easy way. You don't have to travel with any additional binaries in order to utilize them. Almost every Windows computer in the world is vulnerable to them if not patched. What makes these vulnerabilities particularly useful for an attacker is the high rate of reliability and how difficult they are to actually detect. These vulnerabilities would be used typically as part of a ransomware attack chain or potentially as part of a nation state attack. What makes the Black Swan set of vulnerabilities quite unique is the fact that we found so many so easily in such a short period of time. The first vulnerability was patched with July's Patch Tuesday. The next five were patched with September's Patch Tuesday, and we expect that the seventh vulnerability will be patched later in the year, in either October or November. The Black Swan vulnerabilities have allowed us to evolve our covalence platform to actually detect and block a wide range of these types of vulnerabilities. Installing Microsoft patches is always very, very important, but to detect the type of vulnerabilities such as these that are not yet discovered, covalence is your best option. The covalence endpoint will immediately detect the vulnerability execution, block the vulnerability execution. You will be notified locally on that specific computer that the attack occurred and was blocked and isolated, and you will receive an ARO letting you know that we successfully blocked the attack, and somebody at Field Effect will follow up to discuss and let you know what happened.